Hey, how's it going guys? My name is Noah. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for watching. Today is an individual session, something I do once or twice a week when nobody else is around. It's a fantastic way to get lots of touches in and let's get into the video. All right, fam, this is drill number one. I'll walk you through it. So you got two hurdles at the beginning, small ladder. You can either use a small ladder or put a big ladder in half. And then we got one, two, three, four. So staggered one, two, three cones. And then a fourth one right in the middle. And then I'm gonna put the goal right there about 10 meters away. So that's what that first drill looks like. All right guys, second drill. So we have a BOSU ball here. All I'm doing is landing one foot and balancing. We're gonna go four, so two each. Then I'm gonna start here and dribble around, 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 into the six cones here, about five yards away. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then we turn to the right or to the left, depending on the space you have, doesn't matter. Go to the right cone, to the yellow dribble through the X and then play it into the goal. All right, so that is drill number two. Here we go.
What's going on fam? Here we go. Last drill before some juggling fun. We got four cones here. One, two, three, four. I'm going to start at the top, side shuffle back as if I'm defending somebody, take the ball straight through, dribble through this first X, dribble through the second X on the left, around the yellow cone here at the top, through this X, beat the guy, which is these three cones, and then have a shot in that goal. Alright guys, that is it for the video. Thank you so much for tuning in. That is my individual session today. A lot more game realistic than most individual sessions. I know a lot of people, and I do this too, absolutely, is I'll go just through the cones and back, and it's a great way to get touches in, but it's not as game realistic as something like this. So if you can do drills that kind of look like this or derivatives of this one, it would be fantastic for your game. So I encourage you to try these drills at home. If you can in a park, maybe even in your backyard, if you've got enough space, do mini versions of these and it'll be fantastic. Subscribe below for more material like this and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.